very good afternoon Dutch bike blogger here and again a ride from home to work for a afternoon evening shift not that warm I expected it to be a little bit more warm but it definitely is not so I'm a little underdressed in my flip-flops my sl uh, shorts and my sleeveless shirt so that will be cold tonight but gotta deal with it So driving on my bike, actually quite nice driving weather. Let's stop for the woman and child and the stroller. There's probably the little baby in there. It's double because babies are always little. It was a strange move that Van made and I did not expect him to do that. But the normal way I drive here I have to say I actually wanted to drive to work ASAP, but the route I'm taking now doesn't contribute to that. Contribute to that. Wrong. Go here. Well, I, like I said, the weather is cold, but I actually am getting warm at the moment. Yes, I heat up quite nicely and quite fast. Because I'm driving quite fast. Take a right turn here just to avoid these people here.
otherwise I would have been stuck behind them. Of course I can ring my bell, but when there is another way to drive, it's just as good. I looked at uh, the weather forecast, it was tricky with rain or no rain. Oh, thank you very much. No, oh, just great man, school is coming out, more busyness. F. And the skills these people have in their cars, unbelievable. <coughs> what the blue car could have done, waited until the grey car backed out. Then she would have more room to get in. But no, she chose to drive around it and try to cram in the parking lot space behind the grey car, which was turning out. When you drive away back in your grey car, you will need a bigger turn when you're not going straight back. So your nose of your car will be shortly occupying the parking space beneath you, or beside you, on the left side. That makes it quite impossible for the blue car to get in. Traffic analysis by Dutch bike blogger. I don't own a car, but some logical thinking. I would. At least you can it's only logic. Nothing. Nothing special. Nothing new. Just thinking ahead. Now this route is still not hugely popular, everybody gets to the left and not here. Well, still dry, but the forecast is correct this time. It's white and I can assure you they got it wrong on several times, several occasions, but this time they are right. No rain, rain has passed before I had to leave home, so that's a cool, cool thing. By the way, yesterday 
daylight trips forgot to put the settings again back to the normal settings so still have an overexposed video uh, two ones from yesterday going to work getting back from work a bit sad but you're gonna see them anyway hope you don't judge too much what happened I was on a Wednesday evening getting home put the ISO settings and the exposure value to the dark settings and I somehow simply forgot them so I went out on Thursday and yesterday morning without the correct settings the settings from darkness so that didn't get go well and also I didn't check anything when I got, got home yesterday afternoon and the settings were still the same wrong it's a video where I'm talking so it's not the nicest one but please don't be harsh on me everybody forgot something well I could choose not to put it online but why should I I'm not not a robot so I make mistakes and I think I should and could show you my mistakes also for you when you make movies not to do the same when you change your exposure values or even any values mind you remind yourself to put them back or check them I can feel some small droplets falling down on me well gotta hurry at least I'm almost at work thank you very much for watching please like and subscribe also click the bell button for a notification when you like to share something please do so in the comment section below of course I will see you next time have a very nice day and be safe out there